All right, here we are with boots and boot-like things. Um, <laughs> it's a mess, but boots take up space. So there are quite a few of them, but there aren't that many of them. Also, I should not have put these in the bed because I'm making a mess. Um, cool. All right, let's start with short boots. I have these, which are fries. Um, I really like these because they're sort of a, like, lace-up moto style. I mean, they're not technically moto style because they're not chunky or can put the buckles, but I don't know, like, these are just, like, they make me feel punk rock, in, but make it fashion, you know? Um, not that punk rock's not fashion. It made sense to me. I, I can't really explain the vibe that these boots give me, but they give me a vibe and I like it. Um, and I really like to wear them with dresses, um, like just like sort of the lace up Doc Martin sort of look, but they're fries instead of the horns, which I prefer. But, um, so these are, they're brown, obviously. They are scuffed on the toes, they need a little help, they need a little work, but um, they're, they fit, I love them, I wear them, stay. I'm going to put them on the ground because I don't want them on my bed anymore. <sighs> these are new. Um, if you watched the Outlet All Day video, you saw these. I, I don't particularly need two pairs of short brown boots, but I those are not dressy. <laughs> and so sometimes you are you really do need to look appropriately dressed and not like you're wearing punk rock boots that are made for ass kicking. Um, <laughs> So uh, I got these. The thing I like about the other ones is they have the um, they actually have the rubberized sole, where these are just the hard leather sole. Um, and you will, if there's anything even a little bit slippery, I have the these knowledge, working knowledge because of these boots. You will fall. Like you will slip and fall. Um, so. I like to the point that I sometimes because in my if I wear them to work in my office the uh, office is carpeted and then the washroom is um, tiled so if I turn the corner into the washroom too fast I will um, almost fall uh, so you have to be careful I tried wearing the black ones yesterday because they looked real cute with my outfit and it was icy and I literally almost fell down getting out of the car so uh, they're not for winter at all but um I appropriate levels of dress brown boots now black these are my hunter high tops I've spoken about them in a couple of the other videos it's a, it's a similar vibe to the um brown fry the brown fry boots where you know, they're high tops, like they're, they're lace up high tops with, again, that kind of Doc Martin ass kicking vibe. But what I love about these is that they're water resistant, so they're, wa they're rubberized around them, and then there's a, it's a dipped canvas, so it's a, it's a waterproofy material. Um, so these are amazing in the rain, um, and you can wear them in the snow if it's not like a lot of snow, so. Um, these are great. And then, because again, the literally the only black short boots that I had, and I was this was the thing I wanted, I was trying to find for a really long time, and I couldn't find any that I liked, were um, these fries, black fries, which I wore yesterday. They were great. I waterproofed them. Um, they, again, yeah, I say they were great. They were great uh, if you weren't trying to stand or walk on ice, uh, which I was, but they're exactly the same as the problems. They're just black. They're, they're cute. So, um, these are my wellies, my waterproof high top, or my waterproof boots, like my, um, my wellie boots. They have horses on them, like multicolored horses. There's a story about this. I was visiting my parents. I don't remember why or something. Um, and my father and I, who my father and I are not the best of friends, um, which is putting things a little bit mildly. 
But, um, I don't know, remember how or why, uh, it ended up with just he and I at home together and he wanted to go run errands and get something and he needed to go to the store. Um, it's kind of like a Western store. It's not a Western store. It's like a farm <laughs> supply store. Uh, I don't even know how to explain that place. It has everything. Jonas and I decided that in the event of the zombie apocalypse, that would be the place to go because they have um, outdoors clothing and um, also hunting equipment, <laughs> like tree stands and bows and arrows and shotguns, things like that. So if we were being attacked by zombies, we could build ourselves like a fort in the tree stands and have weapons at our disposal and also beef jerky. Um, yeah, uh, it's, a, it's, oh God, these are making a mess because these are dirty because I wear them in the rain and then they get muddy and then they get on my bed now apparently, but I don't know if I'm going to keep these. I, I keep wanting to buy a pair of hunters to wear when it's raining. Um, these, I love these. No, anyway, the point is we were at the store and I went with my father and somehow ended up in the shoe section. I was like, oh, I'm looking for a pair of rain boots, actually. And they had a bunch because, of course, they had a bunch. And so I ended up with these navy rain boots with multicolored horses on them. And every time I wear them, somebody, inevitably, somebody is like, those boots are amazing. They kind of are. But I don't wear them that often because they. I feel a little bit ridiculous sometimes, and it's like also like it doesn't really match. So I think I'm actually gonna get rid of these finally. Um, I've been meaning to buy a pair of tall hunters. I don't know if I will buy a pair of tall hunters. I have those other ones. They say that they're a Euro thirty-seven point five, so I don't even know how they fit my feet because I wear thirty-nine in the third. But uh, <laughs> whatever. Um, Anyway, I have the Hunter High Tops now, and I wear those mostly when it rains, so I think I'm going to get rid of these, and then if I really decide that I need a pair of tall-ish rain boots, I will hold it. I'll just, I'll make the call and just suck it up and buy some Hunters for real. Uh, so, these are going over there. All right. Not my tall boots, it's my brown tall boots. Uh, I might be mistaken, but I think these are actually the exact same style as the short boots. I, I'm not, I, I don't think I'm wrong about that. Um, I love these, they're tall. They're like extra tall, like they come up almost to my knee, um, which is a little tricky because they're kind of getting bent over right here, because of the way, and they have the, um, have that sole that makes it hard to walk in. I just realized there's a big scuff right here because of the way I store my boots, which is making me unhappy. But I really like the cognac leather color on these, um, which, of course, is the same cognac leather color that is on their mini version, their mini me style. Look at that. Cute. <laughs> Um, but I like these. I don't have ample opportunity to wear them because, again, it's a spring-fall thing. And it's only spring and fall here for, like, six total weeks, maybe. And usually it's raining. But, there's those. Um, these are black. They're also fries. They're the black ones. I don't remember what style these are. Um... They do have the rubberized soles, so they're a little bit nicer for walking in when it's wet or a little bit slick. Um, but they're not warm, so I still don't wear them in winter very much. But um, good shoes. I like them. Got them very on sale. So I buy all my fries. Very on sale. Um, these are my winter boots. I'm going to show you both of them. I just bought them in from the kitchen and I was wearing them yesterday and they are salty, which means I have to clean them. Um, because it was very slushy outside yesterday. Um, but 
I basically live in these boots in the winter. This is like, I can't even count how many new heels I've had put on them. This is at least the fifth or maybe sixth heel. Um, I basically reheal them every year because I wear them down for them all the time. They live on my feet from November through April at the at least. So um, they're shearling lined. They're super warm. They're super comfortable. They're very broken in at this point. Um, there's actually not very much shearling left in the sole of these. <laughs> like the heel and sole is kind of basically worn down to the leather, but these are, uh, they're good boots. They've taken me many places, those shoes. All right, so that's all my boots. One pair is going, one pair is getting cleaned. The rest are going back 